Hello and welcome to Texas. For this good race, we were prepared to bring, well, a win. That'd be nice. Um, been struggling recently, but we're gonna hit the number 24, driving home your car, uh, right here to Texas. Um, where in the real Texas race, Things got a bit heated after the race. Jimmy Johnson won the race, okay? But nobody really cared, okay? Because on pit road, Jeff Gordon was about to beat Brad Keselowski. Okay. On the race, with just a couple laps to go, into the corner that we are about to go into, the next corner, turn one and two. On the restart, Jeff Gordon somehow got picked the outside line instead of the inside line. Okay, so he was up here, and he picked the wrong line, he came down, right here, went up, cut his back tire, spun out, and finished 29th. He was not happy with Brad Kozowski at all. Later, they were discussing Impit Road and the teams, as they typically do, all bunched up. Kevin Harvick pushed Brad Kozowski forward just a bit, and then had a massive fight between Jeff Gordon and Brad Kozowski. Also getting involved with a bit of Casey Kane's team. Now, when I say the drivers, I also mean their team. So there's Brad Kozlowski's team, Jeff Gordon's team. Um, Casey Kane's team because they're teammates. And a bit of Paul Menard's team because they were right on the wall. Fines were given to Hendrick Motorsports. Uh, team members, Hendrick said, I'll pay for it. So the driver... So the people that pick crew members don't have to pay for it. The crew chiefs of um, the teams for Jeff Gordon and Brad Kozlowski. Not Brad Kozlowski, Casey Kane. I don't know why Casey Kane's team got involved that much, but they both have been suspended for the next chase races. So the next six, so the two for this season and four for next season. reclaiming the lead here. But it got pretty heated. See, it was sort of like that. Not actually like that. That was nothing like it. Okay. I put him in the side of his car, not the rear back bumper. Oh, fuck you. David Ray again. Oh, this just turned into a mess. A mess. place wrong time really that's what I was doing idiot what it back onto the track what it back onto the track oh there's Brakadowski nice 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 you wanna fight you wanna fight me you wanna fight you wanna fight you that's what I thought that's what I thought pussy out oh no it's one of these races Like I always forget engine damage is on full, so you can't take any engine damage. This all started because I hit him and look it. Austin Dillon got in the air. Oh, we got a car on fire. Who's on fire? Eric Almarola is on fire. Now we're gonna retire and we're gonna see what position we get to finish this one. So we get to go to the next ground. So this is important that I set a good couple laps and then get off the track. Red flag. No. What's the red flag for? What the Oh, you're kidding me. Now that there's a red flag. After there's a red flag, all the cars go into frantic mode. Like they freak the fuck 
out to get off the road. But why are you already on the track, man? That's my question. You see how we rubbed the side of the cars together? It was a bit like that except for it was more of a slam into that caused the whole incident. GTA 5 and drift it. If you have GTA 5 or NASCAR 14, or actually the FIFA World Cup 2014 too, um, right in the description below you have it. And uh, for Xbox, that's the thing. Do you have it for Xbox? If you have it for Xbox, write it below. And um, you know, we can play. We can play online, I guess. That'd be fun, I guess, you know? Be featured in a video. Yeah. But see, after all the cars go out of their frantic mode, they go into what's known as the fire round mode, and it's really slow and dumb. Okay. Oh, wow. Uh, I guess they're setting their times finally now. See, I'm just flying by all these cars. See, here. These are all the cars that advance in the next round this time, but next time, not all these cars get to advance. Nope, nope, nope. Whoa! To the grass I gotta go, I guess. Yeah, I'm just setting times out here now. Ooh. Ooh, that's gonna be major to the side of that car. Come final round. That's really big. It isn't necessary to preserve that side of the car because if that thing goes out, which it very well could, right in the middle of a qualifying run, if that side gets punctured again. So that's got to drive back to pit road and we'll get this car fixed back up. And uh, hopefully nothing else with bad come of this. You know, new cars are wrecking in front of me. This is never good. This is never good when you have a damaged car and you're trying to preserve as much as you can. And you get on the pit road in front of other cars and strategically play it out. It's a lot different from our Martinsville qualifying because right now I thought I was in the pit road, so I guess I'm not. <laughs> You want to start something? I mean, I already got beef with David Reagan. You want to start something? With me? Oh yeah, he aggressively went back after me. David Reagan's in the morning. We can have beef too if you want, man. Now I know I can win Texas. Just like I qualify well here. If I can do this one lap good without smacking that wall. I know the second I hit that wall, that tire is going to be flat. Flat tire and practice qualifying is never good. Come on, hug that line, hug that line. There you go. This year isn't even my lap yet, so. Really try to hug that line now. Because so whenever I said I can take the high side, but for right now, the car can very easily venture up the track. See, it ventures up there and I'll look at the wall. So I do not want that in the thing right now. What might happen though? So I don't make contact with that wall yet. That's what I was fearing right there, that one little hit. That put me out of qualifying. Crap. This is not how I wanted my qualifying run to end. But, that's how it ended. So let's race some Texas.
I don't remember damages on, so however many lives we're doing, I gotta really preserve this car. That's how the car had a blown engine, right? Right, 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 right. It's a good thing none of these cars are the ones that I got beef with right now because we have a big, big, big mess. If we did, that's for sure because David Reagan, Kurt Busch, they, they both wanted to put me in that position before. David Reagan wrecked me to the wall early. Kurt Bush, he did um, some damage later, so. Come on, come on. This is my race to win, and I know it. If I don't mess up, I can win this thing. If I do mess up, though. That's the kind of thing that I was hoping not to get, because that rear tire is already falling off. Dang, this track makes the things fall off fast. And I think it falls off quick. I mean, when I say fall off, I mean like the, the performance of it is starting to drop. Keep wanting to drift, and I know I can't. Can I damage that front now? Let's just hold this on. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Don't hit the wall. If you hit the wall hard enough, you're gonna blow out the tire. That's what happened in qualifying. I blew out the tire. That's what put me back in 11th on the qualifying order. I didn't plan on blowing the tire. Well, I actually did. To be honest, I did plan on blowing out the tire. I didn't think they would do that to me. I did not think that it would instantly end for me and say, you're done. Come on, Vickers. Come on, man, race me. Race me clean. Race me clean, man. Let's do it. Do it up. Final lap. Jimmy Johnson throwing himself into the mix now, huh? There's his name up onto the board of the top four. Here in the number 24 drive to end hunger Chevrolet SS. It's going to be a fight to the finish, honestly. It's how well can you hold up your teammate in the end? Or can you at all? It's going to be a matter of how long does it take to cross that line. I do it, yes! Yes! Oh my gosh, what a drive that was. Name that one while I'm younger. Well, that rear end damage was from after.
and then you gotta get a bit on the brakes. Why are we doing it on this one? That's not even this race. There goes a triple A Texas 500. And that is how you finish off doing fancy burnouts. That's a celebration. <laughs> Winning, but I just won the race, so. Ready to go? You want to back up? Mm. Thanks for being in my video, like always. Let's go. Sign on. Thanks for watching.